Hi friends, this is time and work part 3 and here we are going to learn few of the very important questions which will be always asked in your exam. So now question number 1 is 48 men can complete a piece of work in 12 days, right? 48 men can complete a work in 12 days, then in how many days 36 men can complete the same piece of work? right so they are asking the number of days so here we are going to use one formula m1 d1 by w1 is equals to m2 d2 by w2 where m1 m2 is nothing but number of men women or children anything and d1 or d2 is number of days, months or hours we can say and here W1 and W2 is nothing but work. So we will be using the same formula to solve this kind of question. Now M1 what is M1 here? So M1 we are seeing 48 and what is M2? M2 we are seeing that is nothing but 36. What is D1? D1 is 12 and D2 we have to calculate and what about work so let's say work is W let's say work is W and here they are talking about same piece of work like 48 men can complete a piece of work in 12 days in how many days can 36 men can complete the same piece of work right so suppose work is W now we will put the values in the formula so M1 is 48 D1 is 12 and W1 is w is equals to m2 is what 36 and d2 is what that we have to calculate and work i will put w here right now this w and this w will get cancelled this is left side and this is right side so w and w will get cancelled and now 48 into 12 divided by this 36 will come this side is equals to d2 see 36 was multiplied with d2 when I will bring this side, then 36 will come in the denominator 48 into 12 divided by 36 is equal to D2. Now 12 into 3 times and this is 3 into 16 times, right? So the number of days required by 36 men to complete the work is nothing but 16. So our answer will become 16. Now question number 2. Question number 2 is 28 binders can bind 2100 books in 15 days right so 28 binders and how many books they are binding 2100 books and they are taking how many days they are taking 15 days so you see here 21 binders is nothing but m1 and 2100 book means if you are binding 2100 book that is nothing but work and the days is what 15 days so this, this will become our d1 and then they are asking how many binders will be required to bind 1000 books in how many days 25 days so you see here d2 is given and binding 1000 book is a work so w2 is also given and here we have to find out basically m2 right so what is our formula the formula is m1 d1 by w1 is equals to m2 d2 by w2 right m1 is the value of m1 is 28 and the value of d1 is 15 and the value of w1 is 2100 right and m2 is that we have to calculate d2 is 25 and w2 is 1000 books See in this case binding 2100 book is our work so don't get confused with the work. Now this 20 and 20 will get cancelled this is left side and this is right side. Now 7 into 3 and this 7 into 4 and this 3 into 5 times and from 5 you can divide this by 5 times and this 5 will divide this by 2 times so m2 will become 4 into 2 which is nothing but 8 so 8 binders are required to bind 1000 books in 25 days so that is one very simple formula 
एम वन डी वन बाई डब्ल्यू वन इसका टू एम टू डी टू बाई डब्ल्यू टू दिस ओल लोन वी हैव टू रिमेंबर सो थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग द वीडियो